In this quick lesson, I'm going to show you how the dimensions work in the Design Center here. So we've got two types of dimensions in the program. We've got standard dimensions and dynamic dimensions. To begin with, we'll start with uh, standard dimensions. So we select an object like this, and we may want to know how far it is away from the left edge of the page, and we click that button there, and it will tell us. We may want to know the height of this object, and we click this button here for the height. We may want to know how far it is from the bottom edge, and how far it is from the right edge. So these are a great way of finding out the position of an object and the size of an object. We can turn our dimensions off by simply clicking that uh, checkbox there. On page 2 here I've just created a few dimensions just to give you some idea of the different dimensions you can create. You can rotate dimensions and you can see all different sizes and uh, positions of the object as so. On this page here I'll talk to you about dynamic dimensions. Now dynamic dimensions actually change with the size of the object. So if I measure the width here and the height of this part of the object and I resize it, you'll see that the dimensions automatically update so they're dynamic. And if I undo it, they go back to the size they were. So the standard dimensions are a great way of measuring your objects and the position, and dynamic dimensions are a great way of keeping track of your object's size. And that's the end of this lesson. Thank you.